As the leading surplus lines market, Lloyd's does a lot to stay on top of emerging risks. Part of that effort includes a team of emerging risk researchers based in London. In this interview from Market Scout's Entrepreneurial Insurance Symposium in Dallas, Texas, Hank Watkins, president of Lloyd's North America, describes the emerging risk unit at Lloyd's and how an emerging risk is identified. We have a team in, in London led by Neil Smith that, that uh, is the emerging risk team and they work very closely with the Lloyd's managing agents, the syndicates, uh, the brokers, and a number of outside um, um, organizations such as universities, the press, um, think tanks, etc., to basically spotlight the, the emerging risks out there, whether it's nanotechnology, uh, climate change, you know, uh, behavioral risk is a big part of what we're looking at. Because clearly that, that's not really been looked at from an insurance perspective in a long time. But underwriters make decisions oftentimes on, on what they've done in the past. Clear, clearly they have guidelines. They know a rate structure they want to follow. They look at claims previously with that particular policyholder. But there's also a, a certain behavior aspect uh, of underwriting that, that is not really quantifiable or hasn't been uh, to date, but I think is very, very important in, in, in helping us understand when the market might turn. Because, you know, when underwriter, if there's that sense of fear um, that we've, enough's enough, we've all paid enough claims and, and lost enough money that, you know, we're fearing for our jobs, for example, I think that's a behavioral risk component that, that has to be very, it has to be taken into account. Watkins says Lloyd's has no doubt about what the next big risk may be. Oh, well, climate change without a doubt. And uh, Lloyd's, along with a number of other insurance carriers, uh, primarily European, uh, Swiss Re, Zurich, um, ACE, uh, and a number of brokers are, are involved in ClimateWise, which is an organization that, that we helped found several years ago to, 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 in essence, encourage the insurance industry around the world to better understand what's leading, what's caused climate change, but more importantly, how that might impact uh, your policyholders. Because you think about it, if, if, if people ultimately determine that, that human beings cause climate change, there could be a whole new legal environment um, awakened. Uh, you, they, you could start seeing manufacturers who arguably contributed to climate change being sued for that and their insurers brought into it. And, and you could also see, obviously, um, from that climate change, uh, severe weather patterns continuing and that ultimately will involve the insurance industry as well. So it behooves all of us in the industry to better understand where this is coming from, where it could be going. And so uh, that, that's why ClimateWise was established.